Today I'm going to be showing you my entire Sol de Janeiro collection. I have quite the collection. I've been collecting for many, many years and um, I'm excited to show you guys some of these products that they don't even make anymore. Um, some that are favorites of mine and it breaks my heart. Um, but I'll also kind of go through and just let you know what my favorite scents are from the brand and my favorite products. We've got not one large box of products, uh, but two. Wow, my whole camera shook because of the sheer weight of these boxes. Um, so we're just gonna dive in. I have all kinds of different products. Like I said, some discontinued products, some brand new products. They actually just launched their brand new fragrance mist today. It's their new Chirosa 59 scent. Um, so this one is available now. They released the no, that's not the right one. They released the body butter a few weeks ago. There was a lot of controversy surrounding this product and whether or not it had ingredients that attracted spiders. Sol de Janeiro debunked the whole thing. It was a moment on the internet, but I think we can move past it. This smells so good. It's like a vanilla kind of sandalwood amber but also orchid scent <laughs> i'm like trying to remember all of the notes i actually still have the little card here it's got velvet plum sugared violet vanilla orchid whipped amber sheer sandalwood and fresh vetiver it smells amazing it kind of smells like a slightly more like neutral version of pink sugar by aquilina which is one of my all-time favorite fragrances i have been using this body butter non-stop it's so good it's very thick and amazing it smells so good i actually think the body butter smells more like vanilla and i think the spray has a little bit more of that like plum fruitiness so although it's the same scent i do think that the notes are kind of stronger in different products but either way, both of these products are available now, so I just wanted to throw that out there. We'll go ahead and start with the newest <laughs> releases from the brand. Also, I do have a discount code with Sol de Janeiro. You can use code PAGE10 for 10% off of their website. Um, that is an affiliate code, so um, I appreciate it so much if you decide to use it and support me, but no pressure. I will have the website along with my code linked in the description box for your convenience. But yeah, I'm just gonna kinda go. I think we'll do like, scent categories i have a lot of discontinued scents in here um so this was the first one these are brand new these are still available next we'll go into the classic the og chirosa 62 brazilian boom boom cream this is such a good fragrance i love this this is like iconic for sol de janeiro it smells so yummy i'm not typically like a super gourmand fragrance lover but this smells so good. I think it's like pistachio when something. I don't even know. But it smells so good. And the product is super hydrating. This cream is a lot thinner than the new body butter. This is like by far the thickest body butter that they have come out with. So if you need a nice rich cream, this is the way to go. This is still super, super hydrating and definitely has more of a strong fragrance. Um, but that body butter is like thick and rich and creamy. So this is a classic, so freaking good. Gotta have the Boom Boom Cream. I actually have two of them. I went ahead and grabbed everything <laughs> that I have. So I have a brand new one for when this one runs out. And I actually also have their Biggie Biggie Boom Boom Cream, which I think this is a, a limited edition product that they come out every year during the holidays. I don't think this is available all year long, but let me show you how large this Boom Boom Cream is. This is for the Boom Boom Cream lovers. Look at how large this product is. How many milliliters? This is 500 milliliters, which is over double the size of the original. So um, yeah, next holiday season, definitely check out the Biggie Boom Boom Cream. Biggie Biggie Boom Boom Cream. It also comes with a little like silicone surfboard kind of scooper, which is super cute. This changes color every year so you can like collect them. Sticking with the Chirosa 62 scent, I have the Brazilian Crush Body Spray. This is again so good, so classic. This is definitely something that you're either going to love or hate. I am one of the lucky ones who loves this scent. <laughs> I have been purchasing Sol de Janeiro for years. Back when they had two scents, 
Um, they actually had a third. They used to have a body butter that I don't have anymore, um, but it was like an acai product. Do you guys remember that one? I don't think that it smelled very strong or had a distinct scent. I think it was just kind of like all right, but I did have that at one point. I no longer do obviously, but that is a throwback. I thought about that the other day and I was like, memories were unlocked. Continuing on, if you love the pistachio and salted caramel scent of Chirosa 62 and this just isn't enough for you, they actually have a perfume as well. So this is what the full-size bottle of the perfume looks like and then they have the travel size here which is a little spray bottle which I actually like better than the roller balls. I like that it has that spray nozzle so another classic this is just like a little bit more strong honestly the body mists from Sol de Janeiro are very fragrance heavy in my opinion like I feel like they smell like perfumes typically I think of body mists as being like more diluted and less powerful but a lot of Sol de Janeiro's fragrances are very intense so you don't even like need the perfume but it is a nice little fun luxury to have and if this is your go-to scent, then here you go. This next product is one of my favorites. This is the Boom Boom Body Oil. This is so freaking good. I've used up like half of this. I used this during my entire pregnancy. I just love this. It again, it smells so delicious. And this is an oil instead of just a body lotion. So it just hydrates you in a different way. And the combination of these is fantastic. I like layering them, but I usually use this at night after I take a shower and just really want to hydrate my skin before I go to bed. This is the way to go. It smells so freaking good. I also have this Boom Boom body scrub. I don't know if they still sell this. Maybe they do. They used to have a different body scrub that was like in a squeezy tube and it was this yellow color, yellow orange color, and then it had little blue like scrubbies in it. <laughs> um, but I don't think they sell that one anymore. And then they came out with this one, which is more of like a sandy texture. It's definitely like a drier, like potted scrub consistency. Whereas the other one was like a little bit more of like a, it wasn't liquidy, but it was liquidier than this um so i don't know if they sell this anymore i feel like they kind of like come out with stuff and then discontinue it quite soon it feels like sometimes but this is a really good one again it's that og scent so anything with that scent is fantastic and then we have a few hair products so this first one i know is not on their website anymore they had a dry shampoo and it smells so good obviously it smells good i keep saying that <laughs> it all smells the same it's all the chirosa 62 scent um, but this is their uh, dry shampoo it says it lifts away oil and refreshes with brazilian clay and rice starch it works really well love having my hair scented like this and i'm so sad that they don't sell this anymore i'm currently using this combo right here we have the milky leave-in conditioner this is a fantastic product and then the nourishing hair oil i like to use a leave-in conditioner all over my hair and then i'll go in with a hair oil just kind of towards the ends of my hair just because i do have oily hair so i don't like to put anything too oily up top um so i love to use a hair oil on the ends of my hair these again cohesive scent i love when everything like smells the same <laughs> and it's a scent that you love so this is a great combo um i'm probably halfway done with this and i know that they do still sell both of these products they also sell a comb i could not find it it's like a wide tooth comb i have it somewhere <laughs> i just could not find it and then i think this came with my body oil i do receive pr from Soleil de janeiro i have purchased products so some of these products i purchased myself some of them were sent to me in pr um, this was sent to me in PR and I think that this came with the body oil so I don't know if they sell this separately or if this was just part of like the PR package but um, I do have this with the <laughs> Sol de Janeiro logo since we're doing a full Sol de Janeiro collection video thought I might as well show you that oh I also have a Sol de Janeiro robe <laughs> and a like hair towel wrap thing you know that has like the button on it the little loop those are in my bathroom and i have a sol de janeiro like kind of like beach blanket 
type scarf material thing. <laughs> um, but those are all from uh, like PR packages that I don't think that they sell. But I think I might be Sol de Janeiro's number one fan, <laughs> no joke. So that's all of my Chirosa 62. I actually don't have any of the Brazilian foreplay um, like body wash at the moment. My husband and I went through like the jumbo, um, but we used it up completely. So we don't have any of the body wash. We don't have the shampoo or conditioner at the moment. Um, so yeah, <laughs> I, they do have those as well. So if you want the full hair care routine, the shampoo, the conditioner, the leave-in conditioner, and the hair oil, that is a thing and I definitely recommend it. I went to go look for a few other things that I forgot to grab and while I was up, I went ahead and got the wide tooth comb that I have. So this is what it looks like. They do sell this on their website as well. It's just a nice, cute, simple wide tooth comb. Um, and then I also grabbed my little towel to show you guys. <laughs> so here is what it looks like. It says Sol de Janeiro and it's like one of these that has like the loop on the end and like the button on the front so you can wrap your hair up. <laughs> so I've got one of those and then this is my robe. My Sol de Janeiro robe. Oh gosh. I was like, can you even see that? There's the logo there with the trim, the iconic. Would you call this yellow or orange? I feel like it's an orange, like a light. Or is it yellow? I don't know. Yellow or orange? Let me know your thoughts. But yeah, I do have the robe as well. I also remembered they used to have a uh, hair mask that they don't have anymore. Um, at least on their website, I looked, it came in the same type of packaging, same scent, hair mask was great. I actually recently used one up. And then they also used to have a candle, a Chirosa 62 candle. I wish, I wish they would bring it back. So that is officially all of my Chirosa 62. Now I'll go into, let's do Chirosa 40, which is the um, like kind of reddish one, this one. Smells so good. It's black amber plum and vanilla woods. Also, I have a couple ranking videos on my channel. Um, I have a recent one that I did in December and then one that I did last February. I'll have those linked down below in case you're interested, along with my like initial review of their new scent. I'll have all those videos linked down below. Um, but we have Chirosa 40. This is the large size fragrance mist. It's the same one that I have from the Chirosa 62. This is like the jumbo size. It is eight fluid ounces, but their typical size I think is four fluid ounces. Three fluid ounces is this one here. So this is like a comparison of the new scent versus the like jumbo size. So I actually have two of these bottles. I love this fragrance so much. I think it's so fruity and delicious. They also have this in a cream form. This is the Balm Dia Bright Cream. This one is really, really nice. And it's, I feel like more of a lighter weight one. It's a little bit more like water-based, I feel like, or gel-based than the previous ones, but it smells so good. I love the fruitiness of this. It's fantastic. I actually think this might have AHAs in it as well as vitamin C. So this is sort of like a chemical exfoliating yet moisturizing product. And then they also have the Balm Dia Bright clarifying AHA, BHA body wash as well. Incredible scent and incredible product. So I have these three in Chirosa 40. I don't think that they sell anything else in this scent. I think I have everything from this scent line. The next one that I absolutely love is Chirosa 68. This one is so good. This one smells like Cloud by Ariana Grande in my opinion. It's Brazilian Jasmine and Pink Dragon Fruit. It also um, smells similar to Baccarat Rouge in my opinion. So we have the Body Mist, we have the Beige of Flor Elastic Cream. I think this has collagen. Yes, this has retinol mimicking oil <laughs> and plant collagen in it. And I actually have two of those. I love this body cream so much. This one again is more of like a gel based formula. Oh, it smells so good. I feel like this is kind of like a hit or miss one. I could see not everyone liking this scent, but I love it. They also have a beige of floor body wash as well. This is the skin renewing body wash. So, so, so good. And 
In those three scents, Chirosa 62, Chirosa 40, and Chirosa 68, they actually have this little jet setter bundle. It comes in a little bag. I don't have the bag anymore, but it comes with minis of the products. So if you want to try out the products, this is the way to do it. Or if you just want travel versions. So the little set comes with a mini um, spray, a mini body mist a mini shower gel and a mini lotion so you get this little trio plus a little clear like plastic zip bag that you can reuse um so i have chirosa 68 but again it also comes in this scent the chirosa 40 as well as chirosa 62. we have another retired scent on our hands this is the coco cabana scent um, back in the day, this actually used to smell different and they reformulated it and it no longer, well, they don't even sell this anymore, but, um, the original one was a bit more of a thicker, like body butter type consistency. Um, a lot of people said that it smelled like buttered popcorn. I definitely could see that in the original. This still kind of has that buttery scent to it, but when they reformulated it, it became more of like a gel kind of. Uh, body lotion and less buttery more coconutty um, but this is a really nice scent and I'm so sad that they discontinued this I feel like this is like a classic and it reminds me of the old days back when they only had these two plus that acai power one um, before they expanded to so many other products back then they only had lotions and maybe body mist but I think they started off with the lotions. Oh, they also have a, a foot fetish is what it's called. It's like a foot lotion with like an emery board. That's in the original Churros 62 scent. I used to have that, but I no longer do. So I need to pick that up. But I have the Coco Cabana cream as well as the uh, fragrance mist. This is Churros 39. A discontinued fragrance so sad and then everything else i have is fragrance mists and we still have quite a few so let's get to it first up we have chirosa 71 this is the caramelized vanilla and macadamia this is another very like gourmand scent it smells good to me like i think this is a great smelling fragrance but it's not my favorite i feel like this definitely leans more into the praline like or macadamia like nuttiness and less vanilla like this smells like literal macadamia nuts to me which isn't like a bad thing it kind of smells like a macadamia cookie um but it's i don't get vanilla from this it just smells like a sweet bakery type item which again not a bad thing it's just not one of my go-to fragrances from them it's very strong and distinct and powerful similar to chirosa 62 i just prefer chirosa 62 over that scent then we have a recent release that they discontinued it was limited edition this is the after hours it's midnight jasmine and amber woods it smells so freaking good you can see how much of this i've already used i have two of them i got these in pr um it smells incredible i wish that this was still available it's so good it has like a little bit of fruitiness a little bit of floral the amber mm, so good um so this is a great scent again very sad that they discontinued that one um and then i think all of these other ones oh this is a collab with anita i don't think they sell i don't think they sell any of these ones that i'm about to show you anymore um this one is passion fruit nectar and pink patchouli this one also smells really good i i literally do not dislike a single sol de janeiro fragrance if you want to know my ranking check out the ranking videos um but this one again smells really good it is passion fruit nectar and pink patchouli like i said so that's a collaboration i believe anita is like a brazilian celebrity um i'm not really too familiar with her i think she might do music um so that is her like collaboration with them and then we have a bunch of summer limited edition ones so the ones from this year were when in rio or i should say 2023 summer when in Rio, you can see I used a lot of this one. <laughs> that one I love. It is Wild Bergamot and Vanilla Amber. Then we have Do Not Disturb. This one is Mimosa Flower and Nude Musk. And then the third one is Bikini Season. This one is Sunlit Orchid and Guava Nectar. And then 2022, they came out with some limited edition summer fragrances. So we have 
Sea and Soul, which is Juicy Citrus and Ocean Musk. We have Tan Lines, which is Solar Tuberose and something else that I don't know how to pronounce. <laughs> um, and then we have Tropical Nights, which is Creamy Tonka Bean and Vanilla Absolute. And that is my entire Sol de Janeiro collection. They used to have a lip balm. I don't know if they still sell that. Um, I need to like fill in the things that I don't have because I need a complete collection. Um, but they had a lip butter they also had um like colored ones they came out with three different colors there was like a pink a more red one and then maybe like a nude one um and then they had a sunscreen like uh oil it was so cool it had a little plastic surfboard that floated in it it was amazing i loved that sunscreen um and i think they had a face sunscreen as well like a sunscreen stick i want to say oh they also have deodorants i think i have some of them and i don't know where they are um but they have deodorants in the definitely these two scents chirosa 40 and 68 they might have a uh, chirosa 62 um but they do have deodorants uh what else i'm trying to think back i wish that i had kept <laughs> all of those products but you can't keep body products this, we're talking like five years ago i had these products five six maybe even like seven years ago um but yeah i'm a big fan of <laughs> sol de janeiro um i love their stuff i think it's fantastic i love all of the fragrances and like i said a lot of this was sent to me in pr but i also do purchase a lot of sol de janeiro myself and um i love them so much and i'm so thankful that they decided to send me pr and give me a discount code and just like to be able to work with them in any capacity is just so freaking cool so um shout out to them <laughs> thank you so much sold asian arrow um this video is not sponsored they have no idea that i'm filming this um i just love sol de janeiro and you guys have seemed to really enjoy my sol de janeiro videos recently so i thought it would be fun to do a collection video and kind of reminisce on some older like discontinued products and scents and just kind of look back over the years for those of you that have been a Sol de Janeiro fan for as long as I have it's so cool to look back and miss those products and just reminisce so that was my Sol de Janeiro collection I hope you enjoyed this video if you did please don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up um, like I said, I'll have Sol de Janeiro's website linked down below along with my discount code for 10% off. Thank you to everyone who decides to use that code at any point in the future. Um, and if you have used it previously, thank you so, 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 so much. I really do appreciate that. So um, yeah, thank you so much for watching. Let me know what your favorite Sol de Janeiro scents are down below in the comments. I love you so much. I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you in the next one. Bye.